Go. I'm going to show you how I came up with this alternate for this single shuttle split ring. I'm doing the classic hen and chicks pattern, but I wanted it to turn a corner. So the thread goes into the ring here and out of the ring here. And I have another piece that I've started the ring on. I'm doing the back side. I've done the first three quarters of the ring. I'm going to turn it over back to the right side. Oh, not yet. Sorry about that. I'm going to pull this thread down to just the amount I want left for the ring. I'm going to use the crochet hook. I don't want to join to this thread that's between the rings. I want to Put the crochet hook into that stitch. Yeah. Hello, sweetheart. He just came home from work. I'm going to pull up a loop. I'm going to put the shuttle through that loop. I want to make sure I pull this back down so that it still looks like the bare thread and the stitch. And then I'm going to pull this up tight. Again, you want to make sure that you still keep that first part looking like a stitch. And you're going to turn it over and you're going to fill this little two threads with Dora Young knots. Come up through the bottom, put the shuttle through, pull it up, but don't tighten it. Lay the thread on the top. You're going to come up through the back and pull that thread tight and make sure it's not twisted. Put the shuttle through from front to back. Pull it up tight. That's <coughs> the first of four stitches. And my poor daughter's coughing. And go through the back. Pull the first half up tight. You got to pull these up tight because you're covering two threads instead of one in order to make them look closer to the same as the rest of the ring. Again, the first part is up through the back. Pull it up and not tight. Put it back. Any of you that already know how to cover a cabone ring know how to do this. The only part I figured out was how to join it to the rest to make it look like a split ring. One more. There you have it. So the thread enters here, it goes around and it comes out here. So it turns the corner for the hen and chicks. Of course it could work with just about any ring only pattern. Design possibilities.